Hello, people. Another beautiful day. Yeah. <laughs> Hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good. What? <laughs> now, we talking about Bethesda here. There's a Bethesda showcase coming. Listen to this. Microsoft announced Xbox and Bethesda showcase for June. For June. Starfield, Elder Scrolls, Indiana Jones, Hellblade. <laughs> Says here... Let me get to it here. Says here, Microsoft has announced a new Xbox and Bethesda game showcase set for June, June 12th at 6 p.m. UK time. It says the showcase will be streamed on every video streaming platform imaginable, including YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and TikTok. Hmm. Says here, the announcement is scanned on detail. <clears throat> Though we know it, it includes upcoming release for Xbox Game Pass and the wider Xbox ecosystem. It says here, still it's nice to have some speculation on what's going to be shown. We've over, we're have over we overdue some gameplay footage of Starfield, which is due to be released on the 11th, November this year. Yesterday, Bethesda released a video showcasing the game music and sound design which you can read read about here. <laughs> it says, we're, we may also see more than a logo from Bethesda for the next Elder Scroll game. Then again, we still don't have Skyrim on the play date, so there's still yet more water to be squeezed from the stone. <laughs> says here, we may also see more gameplay or development update from Ninja Theory, a Cine Cine Saga Hellblade 2, which doesn't yet have a firm release date. It says here, Bet Bethesda Studio Machine Game may house also be ready to tease more of its new Indiana Jones hmm? game. Hmm? It says here, which may announce back in January 2021. Other potential showcase includes Avowed, Everwild, Fable, Perfect Dark, Dark, although the Ladders 3 are in very early development, so it's less likely. What do you hope to see in the showcase? Hmm. There, you, there you have it, people. Um, Bethesda and Microsoft. Uh, ever since Microsoft purchased... Uh, ever since Microsoft purchased uh, Zenimax Bethesda, they haven't looked back. And this showcase is going to show you what they were, what they're up to. So get ready for it on June the 12th. June the is it June the what's this, what's this? the 12th. <laughs> I was right. And um, lots to be coming, man. So um, Microsoft, like I said to you in, in the video that I just made, that's uploading right now. Microsoft is 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 trying to finish off the year strong. It's not how you start; it's how you finish. And like I told you, they learned from last year when they released Halo Infinite. They put the multiplayer on November the October, I mean before Thanksgiving, and then dropped the actual game on December the 8th. So they collected a lot of information and data, and they're using that to fuel 2022. So they are really trying to uh, finish the year strong and they're not looking back okay with all the studios that they acquire oh yeah they are busy and they are games coming and um 2022 is going to be a good a, a good year in gaming because you got gotham you, you got gotham knights to deal with that's coming out in october and then starfield comes out in november and then you got of course activision going to drop a call of duty which which they always do and um there's other games coming, so with this showcase, you're going to see a lot of games that are in development, you know. And next year, Suicide Squad Killer Justice League is coming. There's a whole bunch of games coming, so Xbox is set, man, and Game Pass users is loving it. Whether you're an iOS user, Linux user, <laughs> Windows user, and of course Xbox, so yeah. You guys are covered, man, and... um. Lot, lot to look forward to. Starfield, Elder Scrolls 6. <laughs> I mean, Elder Scrolls Online 
is still getting updates. That game is so the amount of expansions that that uh, that game has. Um, it's a it's a lot, man. The game is huge. Then you got Skyrim to deal with. It's just Fallout is still getting updates. There's, there, Microsoft is just busy right now when it comes to when it comes to the Xbox and Windows. They just got so much going on right now. And, um, they did their homework, man. They just they were just making move after move after move after moves. And look at them now, man. What they say, sales ain't the end all be all to video games. <laughs> They sure proved it, man, and, um, yeah, then they turned around, then they turned around and bought, uh, Activision Blizzard, you know, um, yeah, Activision Blizzard, for what, 68 to 70 billion dollars? Yeah, Game Pass, <laughs> you Game Pass subscribers, man, um, you guys are good, man, Microsoft ain't, 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 ain't looking back. They're not looking back, man. And, um, they're they're taking they're taking the um, they're taking the lead as far as video game is concerned, and they're showing it. So with this with this game uh, Bethesda game uh, 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 game uh, showcase, they're gonna show they're gonna they're gonna show a lot of games what they're up to, you know. And um, yeah, and um, go on from there. So yeah. 2022 is going to be a good year, man. And then on top of that, they're working on a newer model of they're working on a newer model of the um of the uh, Xbox uh, Series X. There's a newer model in development. When will that be released? We don't know, but it is coming. So yeah, if you ain't got an Xbox Series X uh, yet, now is the time to consider to get one. You know, but put your money together like I always told you before. So to get one, and then go on from there. So yeah. They're not looking back, man. <laughs> They're not looking back, man. Um, when they created Game Pass, man, once they got Cinemax Bethesda, man, they did not look back. <laughs> and then Activision Blizzard popped up on their radar. <laughs> and they were wounded. And Microsoft just swooped in like an eagle and said, Shh, and got him. Like a fish out of water, just grab them, pop, and they haven't looked back since, man. So yeah, and of course, I mean, Rare, Rare is working on Everwild. <laughs> sea of Thieves is getting bigger. Forza Horizon can't be touched. <laughs> yeah, Xbox man, they're doing their thing, man. So yeah, the Bethesda showcase. Oh yeah, <laughs> get ready for it. Anyway, latest video for y'all to enjoy. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, still a Star Wars and Star Trek thing. <laughs>